Hi, Nicky Trev here, and welcome to my channel. Um, hope you get something out of it. So, I'm not sure how this is working at the moment. So, this is my electronic ignition. Now, I had this in the car for a while and um, wasn't overly happy with it, so I went back to points. Um, and um, so I decided I want to put this back in again. It's, um, as you can see, drop in electronic ignitions. Very simple, basic system. And uh, when I went to put it back, I noticed there was um, so much movement here in the shaft. So, I stripped this down, re shimmed it. And um, now there's not much movement there, so that should make it run a lot better because there was, there was just, there was like 20 thou movement there. And factory says no more than three to five thou. So anyway, the vacuum's working. I've rebuilt all in the side here, cleaned it all up and re remounted everything. So now I've been working on the bike so much lately. The, uh, and the poor old boat's been missing out. So I've had a bit of a play with the um, carby today. I'm not overly happy with its setup. But um, anyway, so what we'll do, we'll go out and we'll fit a new distributor to the boat. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, let's get this camera in there. Okay, so this is what's gonna, gonna pull this out and I'm gonna put that other one in. Now got a little things to do, just connect, just connect that, take that off, and take that green wire off. And what I might do first is check my power. Yep, I love chrome, but uh, when the sun hits it, it can be a pain in the ass. So the first thing I want to do is I want to make sure I've only got power coming to my coil only when the car is off. So let's go get me multimeter and my test lamp. First thing I want to do is make sure my test lamp's working. Which it is. Oh, yeah. Now the next thing I want to see, do I have power coming to the coil at the moment? Nope. Nope. That's exactly how it should be. is on and we have our power which is exactly how it should be now I also want to check on accessories actually sometimes they're still powered up on accessories and it is not which is perfect which means I can have my radio on while the, um, the key is on accessory without having ignition on Right, now let's see, for all intents and purposes, it should be 12 volt here at the coil. And so it's standard. Now I do hear that should be a little bastard. So, hang on, there. Not getting a very accurate reading there. It's saying 5.6 volts. Why well, have I only got 5.6 volts at the coil? That does not make sense.
That doesn't make sense. It's supposed to be 12 volt there. I do hear there is a ballast wire. Music systems are supposed to run a full um Oh, that's weird, I've only got 5.6 uh, volts at the coil. And I'm not sure why that is. I'm going to have to go and do a bit more research. Okay, so. Alright, so. A quick talk to the guy on the phone who sells our electronic ignitions. And he says basically I should be having about 8 volts down here, so I need to be start checking my firewall plug connections and my spade terminal to see why I'm only getting, according to this, around 5.6 volts. And I'll the fucking ignition on again. So, where's my black? Okay, I got 5.7 there. Five point eight there, twelve there, five eight there, five seven there. So, what I might do is I might take this wire off and um, replace that because it's all broken. Looking pretty shitty. We'll do that, I think, and have a, never have another look. Press a lead. Now we'll take this one off here. Oh, it's, so that's really fucked. That's just broken. I will definitely be fixing that. Let's see if we get any. more out of it. Let's see what we can get now. Holy shit. 
There's a full 12.73 volts there now. So maybe this condenser was this um, this thing was causing shit. All right, let's turn that off. I'm put this back on and see what the difference is. That, um, I might have had the wrong condenser on there causing problems. That isn't the fucking thing I even ran. Wire is shot, I'm going to be changing that. <coughs> See what we got now. Nothing. Because my earth is working. Now we're back to 5.8. Coil is crook. Okay. Now I thought I normally understand all this shit. So why, when is it attached? I've only got 12 volts. These are the only ones I can find. There's these ones which I don't like using, and there's that one which is too big. Mum, if you're watching this video and you still got any of those electrical grab kits at home, Bertie's come out in a few weeks. If you're watching, okay, I think I might want to use that at this. 